What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBAsafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. If you guys want some cheap MT, make sure to hit me up on Instagram and Twitter for the fastest and most reliable purchase on the internet right now. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And guys, today we are going to go over the huge market crash off these super packs. Before we get into the video, guys, smash that like button, drop the sub if you are new. That would be greatly, greatly appreciated, man. Also, we might have a locker code video right after this. And if we get 100 likes on this video, we're going to do some MT giveaways up on Twitter and or Instagram. Make sure to follow those socials if you are new to the channel and we are also around 95 subs away from 12k so guys subs likes greatly appreciated man um we're gonna go over filters we're gonna go over high price cards pretty much market talk market crash whatever so i actually been studying for a little bit god i got a little i got a couple opals for cheap right now man you're gonna see a big 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 market crash um these packs man really crash the market not only that guys there's so many opals to go around right now also not only is there a lot of opals going around right now rashad lewis's price there's a lot of rashad lewis is up in price so if rashad lewis is getting spammed on the auction you know the packs are pretty pretty decent so we're gonna go over him honestly i'm gonna buy that with a limited contract why not um so we're gonna go over the thunder filter like i said i've been using for a while we're gonna go over high tier cards Pretty much what you should buy, what you should sell, and whatnot. So here we go, man. Galaxy, Opal, Thunder, Enabled, okay? I'm going to show you what's going on. I got Sean Kep and Gary Payton for this filter. Look how many cards are posted from these Super Packs, guys. Durant and Rashad Lewis's are literally all over these packs, okay? Um, so I've been trying to snipe for the last hour. Haven't got anything. I would just recommend this filter, man. Uh, like... If you see a lot of Durant and Rashad Lewis is flooded in the market, man, you never know what you can get. If you get Rashad Lewis, man, and you get Goat Kareem, I mean, it's just a, such a big W. I really, really do want Kareem. I've been waiting a long time to snipe this Rashad Lewis. It's so hard, but you know what's going to happen with this huge, with these super packs? You're going to see the market drop. You're going to see high tier cards drop in price. And then they are out for seven days. They probably will rise within the next two days because 2K doesn't really drop insane content till Friday. So I guess we're going to have to see. Um, we should see a token market update sometime this week. We also should get a locker code sometime this week. So who knows what's going to go down, man. I don't know what's going to go down. Hopefully we get some fire content. Nobody knows, but you know what? We're going to go over high tier cards. We're going to tell you how to make MT off these high tier cards. Let's get into it right now. So... You're going to see a ton of Giannis's right now, okay? What I recommend, I would say, all right, so right here, this mark right here, the two hours, these these cards, in about two hours and 40 minutes, you're going to want to bid about a mil MT on Giannis. If you end up getting him, let's put him up on the auction for, I would say, around 12 hours, 9 to 12 Eastern. I don't know why, it works every time. I am on Xbox. Every time I've done it, I've done it with this Giannis. I've done it with Galaxy Opal Lamelo. I've done it with LeBron James. I've done it with Tracy McGrady. I pretty much did it with every single high tier Opal besides any GOAT card. So for some reason, man, this method works very well. <clears throat> and honestly, Giannis is kind of price fixed. Let's get into the next card, man. Rashad Lewis, Kevin Durant. There's tons spammed. Galaxy Opal Rashad Lewis. There hasn't been this many on the market in so long. So... If I were you guys, I think right now is a very good time to pick up Rashad Lewis. There is a lot of these bad boys um, on the market right now. And honestly, Rashad Lewis at this price is pretty cheap, guys. There is a decent amount up. There's usually literally one up. But if you guys can, try sniping him out. If you snipe him out, you make two mil. If you don't, if you snipe him out and you won't go Kareem, go ahead. He's the best center in the game. It's up to you, man. But his price should drop as well. Big market crash. Here we go, man. Let's get into LeBron James. Then we're going to get into some T-Mac. LeBron James is down a lot, too. This prime LeBron James dropped a lot of MT, guys. 
I think he's the best shooting guard small forward in the game. You could disagree. All I know is that every time versus this LeBron or Evo LeBron, he does end up going off. Probably because I have Dwayne Wade at point guard. But yo, I'm telling you right now, very good card to invest in. Very good card to pay attention to. That's just what I'm saying. I think it's a very good idea if you do invest in this LeBron James. And right now, I'm just waiting for a locker code to drop. It doesn't look like any locker code is going to drop. But yeah, LeBron James is up, uh, down in price. So pretty much every single high tier card in the game is going to go down in value. Tracy McGrady, 605,000, down in value. Tracy McGrady, 200,000, down in value. I mean, these cards are down big time, okay? Glitch T Mac, probably gonna sell for like 700 fully Evo. He's been selling for 8, 9 fully Evo. On PS4, he's even more. Leap Year T Mac, 200,000 left. He's probably gonna sell for like 320. Last time I picked up a T Mac for 320 was when the last Super Packs were out. Those last Super Packs, when they did drop. I did scoop up T-Mac for 320, sold him for 543,000 with a 12-hour method at nighttime, 9 to 12 Eastern. Not only that, guys, if you really want high-tier cards, you could try to pick them up now. There might be a high bid percentage, but here's another tip. If you guys want, later in the night, I would say around 9 to 12 East, you could pick them up and then do the 12-hour method then. They usually do drop in value overnight. That's what usually happens because there's not a lot of flow in the market, so 9 to 12 East uh, what is it, 6 to 9 Pacific, or maybe you could even do 9 to 12 Pacific, 3, 12 hours east. It really depends, man. It depends what floats your boat. All as I know, man, let's check out the Go cards, because every Go card is in the market. So let's check out Go Jordan. There's three up here. He's probably super unpullable. Magic Johnson Goat is clearly pullable, man. There's a decent amount up there. I heard Wilt was getting pulled like crazy. He'll probably be around 800,000 MT in no time. To be honest, I versed Wilt and Shaq in the same game. I honestly did destroy the kid. He was really good. It was a close game. It was a pretty close game. But the fact that there's this many cards up on the market, you can tell the market is crashing like crazy. So now, what should you guys do? How are you going to make MT if you don't have any MT? To be honest, I would just stick to the Galaxy Opal filter right here. I feel like this is going to be the best filter to stay at right now. I did pick up a couple cards to enable it. I did miss a couple snipes on here. I'm going to buy that Iggy with the shoe as well. So, yeah, I honestly just been sitting through here hoping for some fire to happen. Nothing sickly crazy going on. Honestly, I'm just waiting for some fire to pop up. I've been sitting on the Thunder filter. Um, you could switch to LeBron James filter. You could switch to T-Max because there's so many Opals right now. It's really just a matter of luck. It's a matter of patience with you, Deuce Knight. <clears throat> but yeah, if you have any high tier cards, do not sell right now. Wait till 9 to 12 Eastern. See what's going on. You got Go Shaq. You got Go Giannis. I mean, not Go Giannis. Opal Giannis, and you really want to sell. I would definitely wait. Wait a little while. See what's popping on the auction. Oh, that's a Snipe. There we go. We got David Wesley throwback Moments 4K. Let's check out another card. Let's check out point guard Giannis, see what he's rocking. I love checking out this card. So he's at 146K. The one with the shoes at 203K. I really think he's that good. Then again, bro, look at the spam, guys. You might be able to snipe out a couple for 100,000 MT if you get lucky. So honestly, over here, this is where it starts getting spam. I'm going to throw up a bid on this one. Hope for the best. If I get him for 100K, which I have a couple days ago, man. I got him for 100K. And then this one with the shoe I have in my collection right now. I got him for 127. I were to sell him, man. He would sell for 200,000 MT. Giannis is still one of the best point guards in the game to this day. I don't care what anybody says. He dropped 51 for me in Unlimited yesterday. And yeah, guys, there is no more Unlimited rewards. Glenn Rice and Beasley together are gone. But yeah, guys, it's completely up to you on what you want to do. I would definitely recommend selling your cards probably tomorrow or tonight, 9 to 12 Eastern. Do not sell during the day. You will lose maximum amounts of MT. Because like I said, like I said, I'm just going to show you the Thunder Filter one more time. As you can see, man, there's a million, a million Kevin Durant and Rashad Lewis is up right now. These cards are very pullable, guys. Look at this. Every minute one of these cards are posted. I promise you guys, if you just wait a little longer, if you want to pick up Rashad Lewis... And he'll probably get price fixed again. It's completely up to you, man. There is a lot of flow in the market right now. I would definitely hop up on this Kevin Durant filter. It's definitely recommended. But yeah, other than that, man, that's it. Looks like a market crash. If there is a locker code, 
We'll have it in the description of this video. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Peace.